Start the episode back up again. Hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome back to uh, freaking Necromancer time. Well, now we've got a bunch of bonuses here. Let's uh, let's play Necromancer. Let's see what happens. I like these guys a lot. What is this fairy thing? I don't know. Uh, projectile to scatter. I forgot about that. Okay, so let's go summon. Oh right, I haven't played Necromancer since they repatched it. Ooh, this is gonna be fun, especially with the uh, the newly enhanced Necromancer AI. So the uh, we should we should be clearing things no problem. Oh, they're so much faster now too. Oh, thank you, developers. God, I, I I love how I love how effective the developer is at patching this game and improving it and just making it all around better every single time. Because I I truly feel like this is one of the one of those games that is like it, it's like Vagante was back in the beginning when they were actually making some sweeping gameplay changes before they got really fixated on uh, repeatedly coming up with new character skins uh, for their various for all the various player characters instead of coming up with like better stuff and even then I still respect them for the progress they've got done and I'm hoping their new I totally forgot to fight that thing okay what's this moving speed sure Better than the shield. Really doesn't feel like it's buffed my movement speed that much. Oh well. Um. But no, I, I know the developers of Vagante are on vacation, and I'm I'm looking forward to um them coming back and continuing continuing development and like you know making that game just all around better. But that probably won't be for a while, unfortunately. Which sucks. Also, it looks like my um starting passives have not properly factored in here. I don't know. Okay. I'm just shy of one. Give me some skeletons. Protect me against the bat, which I immediately just murder myself. I don't know. I also like the fact that my attack's home. Makes makes it easier for wiping everything off the map. Home and split. Cannot discount those. Might as well use blood as power. It's not like it slows me down at all, and I can rely on my skeletons for healing. Only cost me like one HP. And then as soon as my skeletons disappear, it's not a problem. Yeah, as soon as they're gone, I get all that health back. Mmm. Let's get this cash while we're here. I'm trying to turbo level myself. Okay. I don't know what that fairy is, though. I've had- I've got this, like, fairy attached to me. And I have no idea where it comes from, where it's going, or what it's even supposed to be doing. But that's okay. Not the end of the world. Up, oh, see a kitty cool games. Have a good one. Okay, uh, let's keep pumping it into defense just a little bit. Just because survival is important. Fight skeleton with skeleton! And then, you know, kind of assist here and there. Ah! You leave me alone. But yeah, blood is powered. Definitely worth it. It's barely barely damaged down it. And this is one of the few characters with a very powerful internal heal. So, really doesn't send me back that much to damage myself every single time. Just to... There we go. So my one worry is... I actually really, really don't have much of a worry here. What is even surrounding me? Why do I have like a... a crazy aura? I don't know. Bizarre. Okay, might as well get the rage. It's not like we're doing anything with it. We do want the, uh, we do want the butterfly wings, though. Okay, and I've definitely, I've definitely still got blood as power on, so I can switch back and forth between them. Oh, let's put some points into damage for a second, just to burn through people. Okay, should be good. Oh, we're at 67 for a second, but then again, I bet a lot of the people were here for, uh, game dev. I don't know, hard to tell. Got a lot of new people, though, this past week, which has been really cool. And I'm totally, totally down for, like, hanging out and chatting with you guys. Unfortunately, I always play the stressful games first, so I can never, uh, properly respond. Anyway, uh, what time is it where I am at? It is currently 1.23 in the morning. Because I am, like, the night owlist, night owliest of night owls. Okay, we should not get stuck on the chandelier. Okay. Oh, shit, we're already fighting the boss. Go, my, my minions. I'm dying here. All right, we should probably turn this off and switch back to zombies. Actually, I might have just turned it on. I totally just turned it on. Okay, well, that's what these guys are for. 
Because when they die, they give me health, regardless of what's going on. We do actually do a fair amount of damage against the Skeleton King, so that that is actually kind of a massive boost. And every time one of my skeletons die, it's like 20 HP straight for me. Which I'm digging. Is the range on that bigger? I think it is. Thank you, devs, for giving me that, too. Man, like, asking you shall receive, and I've asked for quite a lot of things, and the dev sure has handed it all to me. I feel spoiled, honestly. But I'm okay with being spoiled a little bit here and there. Alright, so we're dying just a little bit. Fuck. We got slowed by something. Oh, that's why we're not, that's why we're not summoning zombies. We're just repeatedly toggling. Oh, that's a, I'm glad that there's a, such a major visual distinction for having my, my move on. Because it's super obvious when I'm, I'm effectively risking it. Okay. So let's make sure we don't get a broadsword here. We don't. Instead we get a four-leaf clover. Down with that. We should play Risk of Rain again at some point. Maybe just like wrangle Foxy into learning how to play that game really well. I don't know. Anyway. Let's turn Blood as Power back on. This might be a risky maneuver. Do I only do... I only do 11 damage. as problematic. Hopefully we can get some nice boosts here and there. At least, at least we've got dedicated healing. One of two classes with a truly dedicated heal spell. And I did put some some points into defense. Oh shit! I'm just letting him roll free. At least we got so many HP. Oh, and another butterfly wing apparently. Okay. Oh, uh, what game? Risk of rain. Nope. Death to you. Absolutely death to you. Okay. Let's just let the skeletons tank. I'm gonna take the cowardly approach. Really? Berserker's ring. Thank you, level. For making my life easier. And we're good. Okay, what do we get? Cannonball. Nice. I should uh, look at what the updated flavor text is for that. Because I would actually like to know what it truly does. Okay, so first and foremost, let's... Um, let's level up the skeletons. Vanishes after 20 seconds. That's actually really bad. Why did I do that? Oh well. I should have considered looking into probably just upping my basic attack above anything else. I don't know. Hard to tell there. Oh shoot. I don't even know what we're aiming at. Okay, and I really don't need this foot pad thing. But I'll go with it anyway. We don't have any keys. At least we do damage. What's with the extra two damage? Oh, you know what? I bet that's probably from my, um... Probably from my buff. At least we got Berserking now. Berserking is always a very nice source of damage. Okay. Yeah. So we're, we're gonna clear this pretty fast. At least comparatively. I'm just really hoping I can get, um... Something that just boosts my base just by a little bit here. I wonder if, um, leveling the skeletons... I, I really wish, actually, leveling the skeleton skill would give you different skeletons. So, like, by level 2, you get the sword skeletons. And by level 3, you get, like, a new type of skeleton that, you know, isn't normally in the game. That'd be kind of a nice feature. Just because. Okay, so what do we get? Potion. Thief's Book. Alright. So now I'm scooting. Up, see a Madman Mortar. Have a good one. Okay. Anything else around here? Nope, those are mine. Okay. So let's just keep screwing over here. Oh, shit, my, my skeletons must all still be alive. Either that or I actually don't know. Let's watch our health just a little bit because we're going to take a lot of damage just by being in this room. But only so much. Ow. Contact damage from him was rough. Okay, where, where, what, who, how? We don't actually have anything left, do we? Yep, Redeemer has arrived. Might as well nuke what we can. And get our butts out of here. Hey! Nice old level up. I could try increasing my speed. Oh shit, he was like right there hitting me. I was like, well, we're safe. No, we're not. We're not safe. Let's take out the blade traps before they do terrible things to my face. And summon some friends. Okay. So we're 
we're pretty solid here. Th this is this character has pretty nice AOE room clear. His damage is a bit crap, but he attacks really fast, which is nice, nice and useful. Uh, do we want to go silver key? Yeah, we absolutely want to go silver silver key. Okay, what else do we get around here? Nothing from you. Oh, you look friendly. But not. God, it's so much easier to kill those guys now. Oh, why did I do that the wrong way? Ooh, what's this? Uh, beer! Nice. Right, let's turn our turn our murder aura back on. Nice. I'm hoping I can uh, see what level 2 murder aura does at some point. This is probably going to be the one character I'm not going to bother leveling potions on. Did I summon all these slimes and totally forget about them? I might have. I totally might have. Wait, where are the rest of my skeletons? They're just having a grand old time, just somewhere not here. Apparently. Well, whatever. Keeping me hale and hearty. At the very least. Come on, give me something cool. I haven't seen if there's a silver chest on this level yet. Then again, didn't really check. And yeah, I'm glad my, my skeletons are so... So powerful compared to what they used to be. Like, they used to be nice just in terms of, like, damage, but they weren't, like, that powerful. Also, I have no idea what accuracy is going to do on this guy. Hey, Shadow Panda, how's it going? 65 people watching, damn. Hey, we get, we're getting some good loot here, too. Oh, Shell would react to Life is Strange. Uh, Team Viewer Tour. Uh, yeah, actually, no, that'd probably be a great idea. I just need to get my hands on it. Eh, maybe I can convince Mari to share it. No, they probably got it on console. Eh. I'm such a cheap bastard. Okay, let's just keep putting points into damage until we can get, um, something better. Let's see. Looking good. Just gotta be very, very... Not even careful. We've actually got a really high base defense. What is this? Was that a... Was that a warrior's book? No, that was not. What was that? Wizard's Book. Okay, cooldown reduction. Ah! Closing all the menus is hard. I kind of wish pressing E would pull up both your inventory and your stat screen at the same time. Kind of as like a, a combo screen. But we've got two Wizard's Books, which I actually have no idea how that factors into what our stats currently are. This is a madhouse. I'm okay with that, though. Okay, and we get a shield. Nice! The drop... Oh, right, we've got the Lucky Clover. Go figure we've got so much stuff here. Okay. Oof. Just gotta make sure I don't take too much damage here. We're just getting rolled. Which I don't want to deal with it. Okay. I'm just gonna peg these guys as we run away. Unfortunately, I get the feeling the Redeemer's going to be right in the way here. Yep, found him. Fuck, fuck. Okay, that was close. Oh! Got it. Okay. We're not dead yet. Oh, that was bad. Putting the Redeemer directly on the exit portal is such an annoying design decision. I can't wait until they properly fix that. Oh, we've done this wrong. Okay. Let's get our skeletons on. Unfortunately, we don't trigger the cooldown until we summon the last one. Which kind of sucks in a way. almost wish it would, like, restart the cooldown or reduce the cooldown every time you summon one. Oh, well. Not the end of the world. At least they count as a very, very effective uh, projectile block. And they do seem to have a crazy amount of health. I'm glad that they scale with level somehow. Because it would be very frustrating to have... Wow, they actually do a fair amount of damage, too. I'm impressed. Yeah. And I think I'm on my own for the time being. Oh, well. I'm not terribly worried. Okay, that hurts a little. He's in full-on retaliation mode. Oh! Why does it switch me like that? I don't know. Anyway, he's dead. Okay. That was a bit of hard, fart, hard fought boss fight. Ooh! We get the electric dagger. That's what I was looking for. Chance to shock enemies and since I attack so fast and we might even get split stuff. Okay, I have to look at that item we just picked up. What is this? 280% damage critical chance. What's my damage at? Pretty good. Oh, interesting. It only it increases my base, not my plus. That's cool. 
That is really cool. I like that. All right, off we go to the ice planet. Okay, so we could do soul jar attempting. Or we could do beaker. Uh, let's do soul jar. I actually don't know what soul jar does. But I remember it was like the original, like the OG ridiculous item that I got. I'm kind of looking forward to what it can do along the way. Oh well. You just tank that hit. I don't have a silver chest key yet. Come, skeletons. Kill things for me. Or at least die so I can get more health. Okay, and we're berserk. We should be berserk fairly often, too. That's going to make life easier. Okay. Okay. Life is going good. Okay, we've still got... Oh, does spacebar... Nope, spacebar doesn't switch. I've pressed something that is not... Oh, you know what? It's probably like E or Q. They keep setting off my uh, my skill switch. No, of course. Why can't I summon more skeletons? I don't know. That's just weird and annoying, but not the end of the world. Okay, we've got one skeleton left. Not like he's really that useful in combat, but they're nice meat walls. At the very le least. Uh, let's see, Titan Souls. Let's see. So let's go this way. Get burned out of me easily. Sorry? I don't know. I guess it's very easy to get burned out of, out of like, my content, seeing as I put out so much of it. So comparatively, if you watch every single video, of course you can get burnt out of Wanderbot very fast. Hmm. Okay, uh, do we have anything left? Nope, we're done. Okay, so before, oh, oh, nope, we're not done. Oh! Being directly in between, why is this not firing? Okay, as a very, oh, you know what? You can't use skills while berserk. That's probably how it works. Because I, I was trying to cast, I was trying to cast. Very well, oh well. Yeah. People really want me to play Trove. All right, looks, all like, looks like I might organize Trove for a uh, Catter Day at some point. All right, let's get on out of here. Ooh, mushroom. Not like the mushroom really helps, but might as well do it. Any of you guys have anything cool for me? The answer is healing potions. I'm digging those. Might as well just get potions of rage up in the everything. Okay. No, you can still cast while well, you're berserk. I don't know how that works. On a trove series. Yeah, could try it. Okay. Back away slowly because we're frozen and Frosty the the Frosty the Snow Murder really really wants my flesh. Apparently. Okay. We're good. Ooh, ooh, that's that's bonus defense. That is hands down bonus defense. I know that. Archer's book. On crit, yeah. Let's go with the Archer's book. None of the other things are even gonna help along the way anyway. Okay. Is that it? Oh, shoot, we don't have the uh, damage bonus running. And at this point, we actually do crazy damage. So what did we pick up? No, yes, we did We did pick up a, a defense boosting book. I think it just didn't help me as much as I thought it would. Also, is that my first or second shield? That's my second shield. I wonder how that worked. Okay, any booze tonight or no? I don't drink normally. Do we keep going skeletons? No. Chance to scatter? No. Let's try this. Let's see what happens. 80% damage bonus, 2% health per hit. So at this point, it's 2 HP per attack. But it effectively doubles my damage, I think. And considering I've got built-in healing, I'm not terribly concerned about using this ability. Ooh, oh, wait. That's my pixie. My pixie's gotten more powerful looking. I still don't understand it. Okay, well, let's just put points into defense. I don't even know if it helps me. Butter shots. Mmm. Okay. Give me health. Oh, we are very damaging. Yeah, we do like 50 damage per shot when berserk. This is good. And we, we shoot really fast, too. Stick with one MMO until it keep, keeps going. Catterday crew keeps doing multiple. It's true. Though we... I nixed, um... I've... Me. That's not one of my skeletons. I, I nixed Tor recently just because, like, the chemistry was off and, like, 
bird wasn't enjoying it, so I wanted to rethink that one. I'd love to do MMOs in retrospect. I don't know. Anyway. Hmm. Okay. Uh, is it boss time? Yeah, it's got to be boss time. World of Warcraft part, whatever. Man, I'd love to continue the World of Warcraft Let's Play. It's just expensive. It's just very expensive. Oh shit, my, my skeletons did not live long. Do they? Ah, whatever. He doesn't live long either. Gotta worry about that attack, though. Oh, we are trapped in here, too. Alright, let's just clear the level a bit. Okay, so we're in kind of the doghouse for a bit. At least we got the attack speed bonus. Okay. So yeah, I think Q is currently switching my skills. Which is causing me some amount of strife. Okay, go, go skeletons. At the very least, keep me topped off, because I'm doing, I do lots of damage to him. I just need to be able to survive this. Ah, oh, fuck. This is a bad place to be hiding right now. Oh, shit. And of course, we've we've switched away from the skeletons again. Yeah, so I've, I've got to have a uh, skill switch on what is that thing? I don't think I've ever seen that before. Well, we've got another brain. It should work like crazy. Okay. I don't know what that thing does. I've never seen that before. What is this? Oh, price tag. That's not useful for anybody. Let me try something. No, that doesn't switch skills. E? No. Oh, it's E. Hmm. Ah. Got addicted to Chroma Squad. Yeah! That was a good series. I really... Uh, I might go back to it at some point. Co-commentary style, if I can get Bird involved. He seemed interested enough. Okay. Let's just... Jesus Christ, these things hurt. These things really do hurt. At least we got our skeletons to keep us stopped off, but in such a small room. Without my, uh, damage bonus running. Okay. Let's not mess it up too much. But yeah, no, seriously enjoy that series. Uh, it was probably one of my favorite to stream and record along the way. It was definitely one of my best. Okay, so we could get, uh, we could get some just intrinsic healing. It's not a bad idea, in retrospect. Okay. Unfortunately, my skeleton summoning got desynced here. Which means I can't dump skeletons like usual. Oh, do I want to go? No, I don't want another wizard's book. I think I already have two of them. Okay. Leave me alone. Thank you. Okay. Get burden fall. Ten pounds of bird seed. Mmm. The one problem with, like, uh, co-commentating... Oh, fuck. Why am I so fast? I must have just critted and it's just... Wait, did I just summon, like, four skeletons? No, I summoned three. I don't even understand why I moved so fast there. That was confusing. Well, at least if we get drastically injured here, we can go into super fast shooting mode. Unfortunately, we might also get killed. Which is a bit of a side effect. I don't know. Yeah, no, I must have crit... Wow, my crit chance must be garbage. What is it? My crit chance is 0%. So it's, like, less than 1%. So the chances of that happening are, like... Next to nothing. Go figure. Okay, let's just scoot over here. Upgrade skeletons. I think I will next time. Because it d does feel like they're just a little bit um, crappy for me right now. And I could definitely use something a little bit more hail. Especially as far as tanking goes. Oh yeah, it, it is definitely healing potions that are switching my skills around. That is rough. Yeah, so every time I, try, I use a healing potion, it switches my skills around, which is actually extremely dangerous. That must be from earlier when the control schemes were switched back. And I just haven't reset it since. Either that or it's hard-coded in the game and it's just, fuck, come on, let me leave. There we go. I don't know, hard to tell. Uh, do we want golden key? Yeah, golden key is the only thing worthwhile in this entire mess anyway. 
Okay. Well, we are drastically injured, and my skeletons apparently have not decided to enter the room. I'm dying. <laughs> should probably actually... should probably actually heal. Just a little bit here. At least until the skeletons decide to show back up and net me some of that sweet, sweet Healy juices. Okay. Oh, scroll of revive. Yeah, because I don't even I don't even need to shoot twice as fast to do damage here. It's just Okay, let's see. I'm gonna play Vigante next. It's a new quote. You need more. I mean I, what? I am I quotable? I don't know if I'm quotable or not. Okay, let's see if I can hook some of these shots in. Actually. Let's summon some friends. Then let's go in here. We've still got our damage boost going. Okay, good. Okay, as long as I don't get stunned or stuck, we're generally faster than most of these guys. Being directly inside of them is going to cause problems, though. Okay. Please don't kill me. I like living a lot. Yeah, the one problem is we are currently not equipped for healing ourselves. So any and all damage we take is particularly disastrous. Okay, yeah, those flies can, in fact, shoot at me. Good to know. That cost me, like, ow. Most of my health. Okay, we leveled up, though. Still can't upgrade my skills, unfortunately. I'm still looking for a golden chest, too. I haven't seen one coming in. All right, let's put some points in defense. We're taking a lot of damage. Okay. And I've already, I've seen the shop here, right? It was the golden key. Unless I'm mistaken. Could totally be so. As, as such? I don't know. Either way. What do we got? Nothing for you, nothing for you. Silver key! Yeah! Been looking for one of those. Because we got at least one silver chest. Okay, what a slingshot. That, that's increased split shot. Nice! Let's see. Yeah, no, totally need to upgrade my skeletons. They're not nearly as tough as I'd like them to be. Okay, so unless we get a golden chest in the um in the boss chamber, we're going to be particularly um Oh, I see. Cuz all of my skeletons are still alive, I can't summon more. I was wondering about that. So maybe that's why that exists as a feature. I have no clue. Well, it'll be interesting to see if I can beat the uh, soul keeper or not. I've got some pretty good power, though. Just base stats, not so much. Okay, leave me alone for a second, you schlub. Cool. Let's see if we can take that out. Okay, we're good. He's already wiped out all of my skeletons. Okay, so they are comparatively useless. At least I do a lot of damage to him. Oh, those bounce. Do they bounce? No, they don't. They just, there's all, there's so many of them, it looks like they bounce. Okay. Thank you, Skelawall. You do me a great service by existing. Okay. We got him halfway down and we're not even that injured. Then again, he effectively just murdenates all of my all of my skeletons forever. I'm glad we've got the uh the slingshot in conjunction with um I'm glad we've got the slingshot in conjunction with everything else. Because that gives me a little bit more group clear that I no wouldn't normally have. Okay, seven seconds on seven seconds on Skelebros. I wish I had a vampirism attack. Oh well, it's not the end of the world. Good timing for the Skelebros, they almost immediately die. Yeah, would love to level them up. Come on. Let's see if we get, we have a done run on our hands. I don't know. We got a lot of healing potions, it's just a matter of getting the proper ability to use them. He keeps shitting enemies on us, which I think is a bit of the problem. Because we don't ooh. Because we don't have the base damage. We do when we're berserk, or when we're very injured, but let's be honest here, do not want to be sitting at that.
Okay. Did I level up or something? No, I didn't. My Skelebros must have all died in like one very short segment of time. Okay. Two thirds of the way done. Come on. I'm feeling good about this. Which is usually not a good sign. God, I do like... Eh, I do like 30 damage. So oh, fuck. Okay, the Skeletal Bros died. Ooh, we get a detonator. I didn't actually know these these enemies could get, um... Or drop loot. I'm down to climb with the fact that they can, though. Makes my life easier. Fuck, that hurts. Avoid better. Avoid much better, Wander. We're dead. Damn it. Yeah, we just didn't have the damage or the defense to deal with it. Some of those items are kind of confusing. Anyway, let's go back to the main menu for a second. Let's start. I want to check something. So, what's our defense look like? Yeah? Oh, interesting. So, if you start with one defense, you don't get a bonus defense. But if you start with higher than that, you do get bonus defense. Good to know. Did we get him up to two star? We did. Okay. Hey, Prince Nightstar. How's it going? So, what, what can we do? Uh, let's max out defense, seeing as we're here. And then let's start for health. And crit chance. Can't do that. I don't have enough money. Eh, close enough. We're getting some pretty good upgrade points. Okay, so with that, I will see you guys in the next episode of Dungeon Souls. And as always, thanks for watching.